The Solar Group has been at the forefront of wheeling innovations from the beginning of the first project in the country. We've actually been involved to date in every single wheeling project which is now operating in South Africa. All of the product that we're offering is wheeled energy. With wheeling, the generator site and the customer's load are not co-located. So what this means is that we're able to design, build and operate a large renewable energy facility in a location which is highly optimal for that technology and the load, the customer's demand centre is somewhere else. This means that we're able to find a really good site for the renewable energy facility and pass on all those benefits, including the economies of scale, to the buyer via wheeling the energy over the national grid. With wheeling, at the renewable energy site, there is a meter which measures how much electricity is being generated and put onto the national grid. And then at the buyer's site, there's also a meter which is measuring how much electricity the facility draws from the national grid. So wheeling is essentially a financial transaction. On a monthly basis, there's a reconciliation process and there's a recon of how much renewable energy was created during each of the relevant time of use periods and that's offset against the amount of electricity that was used by the facility during the same time of use periods. So the buyer pays the renewable energy project for the electricity generated at that plant and then they pay ESCOM for the net amount of electricity which is still used from the national grid. So one of the benefits of energy wheeling is that we take on the risk of designing, building and operating the project and the buyer only pays for the renewable energy that's generated. There's no upfront costs for the buyer and we take responsibility for operating and maintaining the facility. The traditional energy model for procurement in South Africa is either that you would buy from ESCOM or potentially look into having an on-site facility to meet your generation needs. With the first option, you're exposed to market dynamics and price increases. And with the second option, you often face challenges in terms of finding enough land that's suitable for renewable energy generation to implement a project to meet your needs.